Like you owe your tax, owe me back 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 like you owe your tax. It's your girl Lashana with LE Style and today I am excited because I have been waiting for this wig to come back in stock and I was finally able to get my hand on it. So today I am going to be um, reviewing um, the Outre Converted cap, cap called Bahama Mama and I purchased it in a number two. Um, I purchased, I actually got three of these. <laughs> but I am going to be reviewing the number two and forgive any background noise. As soon as I sat down to record, here go my neighbor with his saw out there doing whatever he doing, but I'm gonna go ahead and go on, on in the name of Jesus and I'm gonna get this video done. But anyway, um, before I get started, I just wanna say thank you for those of you who are coming back to my channel who are already subbed. I so appreciate you. Thank you so much. I thank God for you. And for those of you who are coming to my channel for the first time, I want to say welcome to my channel. I do have a welcome to my channel, LE Style Channel video that you can check out after this uh, video and you can get to know me a little bit better, of course, and see what my channel is all about. But you will get content like this, of course, all things beauty, all things hair, wigs, etc. Um, as I get further along, of course, I will sprinkle in some other things as well. But thank you so much for coming. Thank you so much for tuning in. And I would like to ask if you would obviously subscribe to my channel. Uh, by the end of this video, I do uh, hope that you would have already hit that subscribe button and of course hit that notification bell so you can be alerted of any new videos that I may upload to the tube. You will be the first to know. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, on to this video. Um, I have my wig cap on and I, I have my hair in four plaits. Well, these two plaits are not plaited right now. The two back ones are still there. My hair is semi, I would say semi-dirty. Um, I went ahead and took out the plaits and <laughs> it's funny because if you have been coming by my channel for any amount of time, you know I am not down with the leaving out the hair and doing all of this because I like things easy. I like them sweatless. I like them streamlined. Um, but since my hair was in the condition that it is in, one of the styles, maybe two of the styles that I will show you with this wig will require some leave out. Now, don't shoot me down now, because I know I am not only no leave out, I don't leave out nothing and this, that, and the other. And I know what I say all of the time. And I mean what I say, but a raw. I have my hair out partially because like I say, it is dirty. It was gonna get washed and I thought this was the perfect opportunity to go ahead and review this wig so I can add a couple more styles in that of course will, will require some leave out. Now, obviously you don't have to leave no hair out. You can do exactly what you want to do as I said before. So anyway, let's go ahead and get on with this wig. I do have my edges. Um, slick down just a little bit. Um, I didn't spend a lot, a lot of time with that. Um, if any of you are not familiar with this wig or Outre's uh, line of converter caps, basically these wigs are wigs that you can convert and wear many different ways. I mean, several. I'm talking out probably maybe 10 styles or what have you. This is just an example. I mean, obviously this is three styles on the card um, and it is again called the Bahama Mama. So this is obviously inserted on the inside of the packaging. I have used, I think I've used two 
of the wigs from this line. The other two I was trying to get, this being one of them, um, they were not in stock. I have used, and I do have a video already out on that, on the Pina Curl Otta, which is this one. And I thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed that wig. So I, um, I didn't do a whole lot to it. I basically used it as a headband wig. But this one, um, I know I'm gonna like, obviously, because it is very, it's a very natural uh, style. It is, reminds you of a natural, of course, reminds me somewhat of a fro. And those of you who know me just a little bit right now, you know I like my fros. This is not exactly a fro, but this is, um, some tightly uh, natural, gives you a, a natural vibe uh, with the hair. Um, actually, the texture of this is funny, reminds me of the wig by Freetress called Willow um, that I recently reviewed. So I'm gonna go ahead and shake her out a little bit. Again, this is in the color number two. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the construction of this wig. I'll first of all show you that it does have a drawstring. So the drawstring is meaning, of course, if you don't know, that you can convert this and wear it in a ponytail. And you can pull that drawstring and you will have a ponytail. Now, I will not be doing a ponytail today because that obviously is gonna require slicking down. Mm, mm. We're not doing that, um, but the drawstring is there. Now with these, you have this one comb in the middle, you have two small combs on the side, and of course you still do have your one comb in the back. One thing that I do like about these that I can say is that um, they do, they're created, the cap is created so well that it's not real bulky up here like a lot of half wigs used to be. Um, it's pretty flat, so it, it lays really, really flat against the head, which I do like. Um, that's one of the, the ways that I can say that they brought them up to date. Um, and they revamped them. So I like the revamp. I like what they've done with this. So we're going to go ahead. I'm just going to leave my um, hair like this for now. I'm going to go ahead and um, I'm going to use this comb. I don't really like tucking combs significantly. It is big head friendly. Hallelujah. Uh, y'all know if y'all watched my last video on the outro, <laughs> on the outre for a kinky, that joker would not fit on my big head. Sister was kind of tight about that. I was tight, y'all, but we worked it out in the end. So if you haven't watched that video, please, please tune into that as well. I thank God that I've gotten to the point where I have several videos, uh, a lot of content coming up now. So you guys can just chillax on, a, on your girl's channel and watch some things. Oh yeah, y'all, look at this now. And y'all can see uh, the other videos that I have, of course, uploaded um, on my channel. So I got a little piece hanging here with outside of the hair. So I like, I, I like what I'm saying. Um, I, I'm certain that I am definitely going to leave as far as the length and everything. I'm not gonna cut on it and try to bring it up. I mean, I'm sure I probably or might cut off a few little scraggler hairs, um, you know, little wayward hairs, but I don't plan on uh, cutting this thing up and having to cut it up. Okay, y'all, so obviously, we got Bang City right here, Bang City. So obviously this, this is just too much right here, but I do want to, of course, show you the style with um, just bangs. This is like a real minimal effort type of, of look. Um, so I'm gonna take my bobby pin, and of course I'm going to just put a bobby pin up here to kind of try to manage how far down these bangs drop.
I'm gonna try not to be snip happy um, on this wig. But I think this is cute. In a sense, I kind of almost feel like I wanna snip down here, but I think I'm gonna chill for the moment. But you can kind of see how the wig is, is flowing. You know, it, you don't really have to do much to it. And you can see, you know, where, where it's hanging or how far it's hanging down uh, back here. So you just kind of really gotta fluff it out, you know? So if you start fluffing it out, uh, you will see a better result. Shake it, fluff it. That's why I kind of shook it a little bit when I first took it out the pack to get it a little loose. So this, this, this is much better. This is much better. Now, this probably isn't going to be my favorite style, but hey, it's, it is an option, you know, for you to wear the wig. So, uh, tell me what you think about this. By the end of the video, guys, tell me which look is going to be uh, your favorite look. So we're going to go ahead on to style number two. Okay, so this is what we're going to do for style number two. Now I am, and don't don't be talking about me because I know this don't this is not really matching my attire today. But I wanted to use this as the first thing I can get my hand on, like a little fabric headband, um, not a full scarf. I'm sure I could have got a scarf, but honestly, I didn't feel like looking for one. This was the first thing. And what I'm gonna do for this style um, is basically, and that's why I kind of left uh, everything like it is right now. You know, I got a couple extra little pieces hanging down. So if I were to wear, and see, I'm just gonna go on and cut that piece cause I ain't got time. So if I'm gonna wear something like this, you know, this bang got to be right now. So this is just another, this is an option. So y'all tell me what you think about this. Okay guys, so we have this style obviously. So now I'm gonna go ahead and just do this. So of course I have a large ponytail holder. This is an option for you. So I'm gonna let you see the side of that. And the side of that. And you can see, of course, you can see the back. So that could be an option, um, a style option. Now we're gonna go on to style number four, y'all. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this tie, um, this little wrap off, take this ponytail holder off. I'm gonna go ahead and remove these bobby pins because I'm gonna kind of shift what I'm doing here. This obviously would be a style and I, I think out of all the ones so far, this is, y'all, <laughs> Y'all know I like a side part now. Come on now, y'all know I gotta get the side part action or the faux side part action going on. So we got a couple of pieces of hair hanging down. I'ma I'm go ahead and snip these two little couple of pieces because for the most part, um, you know, the hair is gonna be out. And I mean, I'm not saying that it got to be perfectly shaped, but I'ma go ahead and get rid of those little pieces um that's hanging down down so yeah so this is what we got 
right here. So this is cute. Yeah, I like that. Now, I think this is my favorite style, style so far, so far. Of course, we got some more to go. Okay, so obviously we can leave this like this. We can reintroduce this. This is cute, you know, to wear it like this uh, with this tie. It's another option, obviously, uh, for you with this wig. I like that. I think that's really cute. That is a really, really cute. Let's go ahead and get rid of this. This is just, you know, just a little piece of something out, you know. When it's not extreme, you don't have to do it. And normally, you know your girl wouldn't be bothered with no, no hair out of nothing. But um, with the state in which my hair was in, I figured I would go ahead and rock with it and give you guys a, a, a little treat, obviously, uh, being that I normally would not do that and just for, like I say, demonstration purposes, um, just to show you. So I think that that's cute. It's really cute. All right, guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this, these two bobby pins out. I like that, y'all. Mm, yes. I'm liking the way that's looking. And I can tell as the more that I'm handling the wig, you know, it's, it's kind of getting that uh, keep your shape power going on. So now it's like it's staying a little bit more because I've been handling this front part. The back, not so much. Not that the back, even though I haven't seen the back yet. Um, but... It's, it's definitely uh, got some keeping your shape uh, power going on. And see, I got some little, little pieces back here that are trying to say, what about me? And I'm not down for it. So I am digging this one right here, honey. Yes, this is giving me my... Uh, my all of my bigness that I like. So you guys let me know what you think about this style. Now we are like at the end, almost at the end. Um, and this was, like I said, one of the reasons that I really wanted to um, pull out some of my hair. So I'm gonna take the wig off just for a second. The hair is so, what's the best word, um, manageable. You can move it around like so easily. I mean, and like put it in place because again, I'm just trying to cover this little bun that I have here and um, see? That's what I wanted to do. 
So this is another option, obviously. I think this is really, really, really cute. I think this style, this style is like, it's very youthful. I mean, I'm 51 years old. Um, certain styles, no, I'm not going to do the two, but I'll do one. Um, the two is just not for me. You could do two little ponytails, two little twisty, what do you call it? I don't know. You could do two right here. I'm not interested in that. But one, I can do. But this style is very youthful looking. Um, I like it. I, I, I really do. Well, this definitely is my vibe. I, I really, I like this. It's, it's so comfortable. This wig is so comfortable. I'm just like digging it. Yes, baby, digging it. So I got one more option and then we're going to be done with this wig, y'all, because I think we got through a lot um, and that's going to be it. Okay, so the only other thing that I want to do, obviously the hair is going to stay in its place. But just to show you um, this style with just a little bun on top. I like this. I really, really now, this, like I said, this, <laughs> this is really what I was really wanting to get to uh, with this wig because I like this, this look, you know, this, um, I don't know. I don't know what you call it. It's just a half up, half down as far as I know. But it looks very natural. I mean, to me, it does. I mean, especially because I do have my hair out, you know, right here. And, you know, my hair isn't so straight that it looks like, you know, it could potentially. And I mean, I just, I like this. I like how free and easy it is. You guys let me know what you think about this. I really, really like this. Like I said, I have been wanting to get this wig for at least the last three months. It was completely sold out. It's super duper cheap. I think I paid $15 or $16 for it. I actually purchased three of them because they have been out of stock for a long time. And so when I know that I know that I know that I'm gonna like something, especially when it's been hard to get, I'll go ahead and just, you know, for $15, $16, I just bought three, but I did buy two different colors. This was the only number two um, that I bought. So you guys let me know what you think. I thank you again um, for coming back to see me today, for rocking with me, for vibing with me. I thank you for everyone again who has already subscribed to my channel. I'm asking for those of you who have been on the fence or who, who have not subscribed already, hit that subscribe button, please. And thank you. Yes, this is a big old, big old wide world of YouTube. There are many, many people that you can watch, but there is only one Lashana and one LE style. So I appreciate you so much for hitting the subscribe button and hitting the notification bell, of course, to be notified of any more videos that I will have uploaded, you will be the first to know. Thank you so much, guys. I love you. Please sound off in the comments, letting me know how you like the wig, which style was your favorite style. And of course, whatever else it is that you're interested in seeing. Of course, I wanna bring content that you are interested in seeing. And obviously, I mean, I want to bring content that I enjoy bringing to you as well. With that, have a blessed day. I will see you guys soon. Be blessed. I love you guys. Bye.